Welcome to Wednesday, February 20th's Daily Report. The lone team in action last night was the men's basketball team. They traveled to NC State, dropping their first game to the Wolfpack in four games, 84-66. Tonight, the baseball team will be playing their postponed game against Jacksville Dolphins today at 4 p.m. Also in action tonight is the softball team. They're on the road for the first time this year, taking on in-state opponents, the UCF Knights in Orlando. Going on the road for the first time is, you know, a challenge in itself. So, and definitely we know Mackenzie Otis is a good little pitcher and she's done some good stuff. So um, we're, we're up for the challenge and uh, this is going to be a, a great kickoff to the weekend in California. Lastly, the swim team will take it to the pool for the Women's ACC Championships. The event begins today and will run through Friday. Well, I think the women's team this year, it's been very competitive. Um, we're actually, you know, when you have to make those selections of 18 athletes, you know, we've got two great divers and we've got 17 great swimmers. And to be honest, our 18th, 19th, 20th, 21, uh, those swimmers could all go to the meet and have a chance of scoring in their primary events. Uh, when we have to, when we make that decision, we have to basically take people that are going to score in two events or three events and really help with the team total. So we may well have a couple of our you know, non-ACC kids go to Georgia in a week and, uh, and basically get close to making an NCAA qualifying time. That'll do it for today. Stay right here for your complete Seminole coverage. Reporting for Seminoles.com, I'm Jonathan Shalasi.